stay dry for some reason because
is contained in of fruits and flowers, nothing musky or overbearing, something that puts me away from perfume. Every single scent, scent per scent, I cannot stop. Every single scent that Scentbird sent me is perfect for me. Oh, and P.S. Scentbird is a flexible subscription service, meaning you can skip any month without penalties. Right now, you can use my code to get your first month of Scentbird for just $11. All you have to do is click the link in my description and get subscribed today. And with that being said, thank you so much, Scentbird, for sponsoring tonight's video, and let's get right back into the roleplay. Okay, so this is, I don't know, but I'm going to give this to you at an extremely good price just for the fact that you looked at it and it seemed like you were concerned about the stuff on the top, so I'm going to give you about 150. No, honey, not 150 likes equals one prayer. $150. <laughs> Have you seen this out anywhere lately because of everybody getting sick? You really think that anybody's out at their department store right now selling perfumes? You should be grateful you're in here right now and you don't seem very grateful, so... Well, let's put it to the side. This right here. Yes. So, this right here is a body mist. It's not really a perfume. So, I don't know. Were you judging by the smell you were when you came in? It doesn't seem like anybody really educated you on scents. I mean, unless you're considering your natural scent, sweetheart. Well, in that case, that's pretty terrible and disappointing. So this is the Brazilian Crush. It's one of my absolute favorites. I have this at home. I may have brought this in from being at home, from sitting in my drawer from over a year, because I started eating snacks while getting ready in the daytime before work, and then I would put, like, all the packages, snacks, in this drawer, and that just so happened to be the same drawer that I had this Brazilian Crush. So... I was like, well, if I'm not using it, then I'm sure the store could do so well. You know what this always smells like? You know those roasted almonds at, like, fall festivals that the church hosts every year? No? Okay, well, do you know about your local gas stations that sell the roasted almonds and things like that that have been sitting there for weeks at a time? Yes. Well, now you do. Go ahead and give it a scent. Give it a sniff. Oh, did I spray a little too much? Yep. Cough it out, but please, cough over on that side. Just because I'm protected by the blood of Jesus from COVID doesn't mean that blood of Jesus doesn't have to bless 7 billion more people in this world than he's taking too long to do. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. They love me at church. Okay. So I'm just gonna go through right here and write down that we tried the Brazilian crush. It does smell a little bit too mixed in here, doesn't it? So don't tell my girls at the weekly bath 
Mexican parties, but <laughs> Jared Leto in the Bloom commercial, just absolute A-plus chef's kiss. It just round of applause. He is just gorgeous. Yes, and that is why <clears throat> this was mine too, but I'm trying to sell to get a fake vaccination card. <laughs> oh, oh, shh, shh, shh. We can't say that out loud. We can't say that. Well, yeah, I want to go to a Jared Leto concert, but, you know, oh, whenever he's not running his cult, by the way, but it's just all for Jesus. We love everybody for Jesus. For Jesus. For Jesus. Like, Jesus. Yeah, he's all over the place about what he believes in, but girl. Anyway, so yeah, I'm trying to sell this one right here because it's the most expensive and I'm going to buy a fake card because like I said, blessed and you got it and I'm going to go to his concert and ask to join his cult and it's just, it's going to be precious and I'm going to leave all of this behind. All of this behind. Oh, um, it smells like... smells like flowers, but let's get another um, go ahead, give it a sniff, go something like that for me. Thank you. Oh, the mall I went to. Yeah, it was up in um, Eastside. Yeah, the one up in 
side, the one with the, the one that for some reason has like the one cheesecake factory and then on the complete opposite side literally has another cheesecake factory. Yep, that's the one. I don't remember which department store it was, but it was the one that sells perfume, so you'll be good. Oh my goodness, you're so awesome. I'm so glad I met you. And again, I'm so sorry I was so rude to you in the beginning. I didn't no, I didn't mean it. No, I really didn't mean it. I can't believe it. Yes, I did plan on buying a fake card. Oh, they sell them everywhere. It's just, you gotta know the right people. I can't give you out the name. It's something I just planned doing. Yes, actually, how did you know? I did actually used to do art at one point in time. <gasps> That's insane. Do you recognize me or something? Did you recognize my work? Yeah, I used to work downtown. I used to work uh, in this old apartment building. Um, I've been to jail a few times. Don't tell anybody. I know, and now I was, you know, I started going to church and met some really awesome older women and yeah and like I said my goal is to be with Jared Leto I'm gonna go right up on stage and just need to show proof that so okay well I'm really excited for these tickets do you know how long it's gonna take for you to be back your back and I'll see you soon then. Thank you. All right, I'll see you soon. Bye.